Hey guys, welcome to Rithi Defined. My name is Saro. As the COVID-19 pandemic is still raging all over the world, there is a shortage of medical supply and personal protective equipment. A mask is one of them. Commonly used masks are surgical and N95 masks. A surgical mask is a loose-fitting disposable device that creates a physical barrier between mouth and nose of wearer and potential contaminants in the immediate environment. If worn properly, a surgical mask is meant to help block large particles of droplets, splashes, sprays or splatter that may contain germs or viruses, keeping it from reaching your mouth and nose. Surgical mask may also help reduce exposure of your saliva and respiratory secretion to others. An N95 respirator is a respiratory protective device designed to achieve a very close facial fit with very efficient filtration of airborne particles. The N95 designation means that when subjected to careful testing, the respirator blocks at least 95% of very small, that is about 0.3 microns, test particles. If properly fitted, the filtration capabilities of N95 respirators exceed those of face masks. However, even a properly fitted N95 respirator does not completely eliminate the risk of illness or death. N95 respirators are not necessarily general public. Those are the critical supplies that must continue to be reserved for healthcare workers and other medical first responders. Also, CDC recommends using cloth face covering for use by the general public. Well, a typically mask is worn once and then discarded. Heating it, cleaning it with soap and water can also be used. But what if we can use a single mask multiple times? or get the raw material that is filter and use it again. Today, talking about the 3D printed masks, some of them are approved by the FDA and some are used by doctors as PPE equipments. All the 3D printed mask links are given below. For this, there are many mask 3D models available online. So we made the most commonly downloaded models. Let's start with Montana mask. This mask is used by major hospitals in Montana, Texas, California, Georgia, Colorado and other states. This is a popular mask and used by doctors. They made a website for this mask where they accept donations of the mask. For more information, visit their website. And we have printed this mask. It consists of two parts, the main shell and the filter plug. We printed this using PLA with 20% infill, 0.3 layer height, 55 mm per second print speed and the whole mask took 6 hours to print. The mask is then cleaned for any burr. It is fitted by a rope or rubber which makes it wearable and makes sure it's nice and sanitized before fitting in the filter. It is a nice and comfortable and we felt that gasket is not needed for general use if you are not medical personnel. To test if the mask is printed properly, don't insert the filter or the plug. Wear the mask and cover the hole with a palm. Take a deep breath inside and see if you can breathe. Ideally, you should not be able to breathe and feel a strong suction on your palm. This means no air is entering the mask. This will ensure the mask has no open gap and air will be coming in through the filter. If air is entering through the edges, print may not be proper or you may need to use a gasket to seal off the edges. Next, we printed the Bolivar mask which took just over 7 hours to print with same properties as the Montana mask. This mask is also used by doctors. This mask has a larger filter area which is comfortable to be used for long shifts of 8 to 12 hours. This is version 3 of the mask. The maker developed the mask on the feedback from doctors. For more information, visit their website. And we have also printed this mask. It's clean and deeper, sanitized and fitted with a filter. It's comfortable and it is much more easier to breathe in due to large filter area. Both masks are well made and function properly. Bolivar mask has a bigger filter which makes it easier to breathe even for a long time span. Whereas the Montana, the filter is smaller and it's suitable for small time span with regular breaks in between. And according to their sizes, Bolivar needs larger filter and Montana needs smaller. If you're not an essential worker, Montana will be a good choice. And for essential worker, Bolivar will be much more comfortable. There are also many other masks like stopgap surgical face mask. This is FDA approved first 3D printed mask for COVID-19 support created by the VHA team. The 3D printed stopgap face mask is a personal protective mask. Healthcare workers can use this for liquid barrier protection to the novel coronavirus. Next, Rowan 3D printed mask. This mask is developed by the Henry M. Rowan College of Engineering, New Jersey. They have designed three sizes of the mask, large, medium and small, according to the face size. Developed in collaboration with medical professionals, the mask prototype may serve in clinical and field use. If printed, used and maintained correctly, 
the mask provides a durable reusable mechanical barrier the most important reason to use this mask is that we can take a single cloth mask and cut it into multiple pieces according to the filter sizes so a single surgical mask can be cut into 3 or 6 parts depending on the filter size and be used 3 to 6 times rather than using a surgical mask once and discarding it hence saving a lot of material and rationing essential well i hope you guys have liked the video also if you are printing this mask make sure that no air is entering through the edges thank you for watching stay safe and keep printing